Uh. So I just made a little um, comparison video about a few Indiegogo True Wireless headphones a while ago. And in this little um, roundup there were also the Air by Crazy Baby, um, it's lying just here, and also the Air by Crazy Baby uh, Nano. Baby, baby. The Air by Crazy Baby Nano. And I just had this in this lineup and I just made a little comparison about it and said where were, where were the good ones and the bad ones, the Palm Scroll, Sound Flux, etc. But um, today I just want to make a dedicated video about the Abba Crazy Baby Nano because I think um, they're worth it. Um, I really love them and they have a few downsides I also want to talk about and I just want to give you some guidance if these are really worth it for you. Here we go and welcome to the idea of technology. My name is Michael and today it's all about the uh, by Crazy Baby Nano. I just call them the Nano because um, the name is just way too long. Um, Air by Crazy Baby isn't too long and so I will just call them Nano. Um, it's just way easier. So today we're just talking about this and I think they're pretty amazing. They have a few cool sides and a few cool um, things. Um, I just want to cover in this video. Also, um, just to mention this um, first um, up in front, um, there are also um, the Nano S1, so S like from the um, Air by Crazy Nano, um, Air by Crazy Air S1 by Crazy Baby, and also the uh, Air Nano S1 by Crazy Baby. So um, there are these are the predecessors, and there are just some newer versions of them, so just keep this in mind. These are the two older ones, as I can say. Um, the difference um, by at the air is bigger because um, they just changed Bluetooth 4.2 to Bluetooth 5, but today we are just talking about the Nano, and from the Nano to the Nano S1, the difference isn't that big. Um, just a little bit better sound, um, longer battery life, and just a few little things just like um, other colors for example so um, just you can decide for yourself if you want to go for the nano or just for the nano s1 but i want, just wanted to cover this here so as the name claims um, nano means they are just extremely small but if you compare to the funkel w1 i here in my right hand um, the case of the Funko W1 is even smaller than from the Nano, but the Nano is just already pretty, pretty small. It's just like this little egg here. And I really love them, and because you can just throw it in your bag and you will just have not the feeling that they're weighing a lot and or just um, depending so much uh, on space in your bag. So let us just start with the capsule or with this charging case. And you can charge your uh, Nanos um, up to three to five times with this little case and it's extremely fast, some sort of super fueling um, as Crazy Baby called by themselves. So you just need five minutes and you can have a few hours of um, playback time, which, which is pretty good. On the um, other side, also really important is you just get a USB Type-C port, um, which is just pretty rare uh, still nowadays in 2019, but you get it here and um, which is just pretty nice. So you have just one ecosystem of um, connectors. Another thing that is probably pretty important um, for some of you out there, you just get a huge amount of different colors when it comes to your nanos, which is pretty cool because um, now it's more like a lifestyle gimmicky thing and you can just choose the color you just want. It's just pretty amazing. I just go for black because I'm black. I'm wearing a black t-shirt and I'm black inside, so um, this is probably the thing I will go for. The downside of the um, um, color, in my opinion, is all the color for itself is that it's always this uh, piano coating, so you just see scratches or fingertips pretty easy. I don't like this so much. I would be more likely to go for some matte black, but um, this is not so common, sadly. Another thing that bothers me more than it should be is um, the locking or opening mechanism. It's just um, a magnetic connection, but if you just open it, most likely you will just open one side and not both sides at the same time. You just pull it um, 
um, to the outsides of the case and then it's just open but it's completely um, flimsy and uh, flickering and it's not so stiff and it never feels really good so the build quality and this is the downside to the air by crazy baby because this comes with a completely different enclosure made of aluminum and made way more premium but um, with the air um, nano by crazy baby you just have this case which is it's feeling pretty cheap to be honest but it's coming with the usb type c port so um, you just have to figure out for yourself if you want to sacrifice a little bit of build quality for the way better um, charging standard in my opinion. So here we have them, the Air Nano. Um, also a little bit tricky is um, that the um, magnetic connection in here um, is a little bit flimsy so you just always need to, to figure um, out if they are just fitting really well into the case and if they are really charging. This is not always the case if you um, look at them and um, it seems to be bad you just need to um, flick it a little bit around to, to see if this is really charging but um, you will have this LED charging ring on your earbuds itself so you just can see it pretty easy but um, you will never have the feeling to do this um, blind without looking. The earbuds itself are more likely for their name Nano because they're extremely tiny um, the shape is a little bit special so you need to like it I must be honest this is not the right um, ear but for me because um, I don't like the shape it's not for me ergonomically they're standing out a little bit out of the ear and it's not like they are laying um, right into the, the, the shapes of your ear um, in my opinion but that depends on your ear you get a variety of ear tips which is also pretty nice um, but uh, this is more like um, as I would expect um, from a true wireless headphone so you can just choose the ear tip that's best, best fitting for you and also um, they are coming with Bluetooth 5 which is in my opinion probably one of the best sell selling points um, back then so they are also just I think two years old I don't know I think around about this and um, so um, this is also a big bonus so you can always go for your Bluetooth 5 um, smartphone and um, have a really good and reliable connection um, to your um, earbuds. And connection is not everything, but um, to be honest, the sound quality is extremely good because Crazy Baby um, only uses um, carbon nanotubes and diaphragms um, for the drivers. And I must be honest, they are really, really good um, when it comes to covering the whole frequency from the absolutely lows to the mids to the highs. Um, they are just really, really good. Um, I have nothing here. Um, that is nearly as close um, to the sound quality of the uh, Crazy Baby headphones, especially the Air Nano by Crazy Baby. But I need to tell you something else about Crazy Baby itself, because I have some sort of ambivalent um, uh, opinion about this company, because I'm not, I've found it a few of their headphones, I'm totally aware of this, but um, the first problem with the Air was, and I need to call you out, Crazy Baby, on this, um, when I got them one week later, um, the rear earbud was just broken or just damaged and was not working anymore. And it took me around about three to four months to get um, a replacement for this. So this was way too long. Um, pretty, pretty annoying. And when it comes to the Air Nano, um, I just um, bought two of them. So. Um, um, two, um, one was the white and one white one and one black one. So I just bought two of them and I only got this one. Because the white one was just lost somewhere in the process of transporting to, to my house, but um, Crazy Baby just refused to send me another one. And this is just not the best customer service at all. So Crazy Baby, I'm still waiting for the white one. I'm super annoyed and really <laughs> off um, that you just did this because, um, yeah, it wasn't my fault. Um, maybe it wasn't even your fault, but I think um, to have some sort of positive um, uh, customer feedback, that would be something that you can just cover. Um, I would just want to have my other uh, pair of Air by Crazy Baby. So overall, if you can live with this pretty cheap case and with the ergonomics of the headphones, I can absolutely recommend them. So um, for $99, you get a really, really good deal. Um, 
but also you must be honest, um, there are some other competitors out there that are cheaper, for example the Funkel W1, and they provide nearly the same performance or just even better in a few things like maybe the um, soft touch controls, because here you only have the hot buttons. Um, but um, just keep this in mind and if you just want to spend them and you want to have some fancy color, just absolutely go for the Air Nano. Um, but if you want to spend $30 more and have some new colors, um, even battery life and even a little better sound, just go for the Air Nano S1 by Crazy Baby. If you don't care, um, just go for this one or just look for something else on Indiegogo because they are also just coming a few different um, true wireless headphones out there that they're also just pretty amazing. Okay, that's it. So if you dislike this video, you know what to do. But if you liked it, hit like down there, get subscribed and enable the notifications with a bell icon so you won't miss any future video of the idea of technology. And I just want to say thank you very much for watching this video. Have a great day. Bye.